what's up guys it's your girl ella and today we're going to be doing a what's in my makeup bag that i carry pretty much everywhere with me um i'm just going to show you what's inside most of the products you have probably already seen but i did get get some new products i just recently got my sephora play and it's a subscription box and you get five mini size beauty products to try and they're really good. I love Sephora Play. It's my second month getting it. Um, so yeah. Um, and let's just go ahead and jump in. So you guys know I always carry with me my duochrome highlighters because I use highlighters every day. Also, I carry my NYX concealer. Um, and it is the HG Studio Photogenic. I know you guys have heard me say that like 800 times, but I'm just recommending this because it's great, it's cheap, and it comes with a good amount. Um, this is a new product, and this is my Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder. I actually purchased this from the dollar store, um, and it was, I think it was like five, six dollars? It has great, like, look at that gorgeous color. It's called Blossom Glow. And the pigment, like, when it catches the light, like, it's just gorgeous. Definitely a steal. Next, we have my, which I haven't been using this as much lately because I haven't been doing as much hardcore blending. But this is my e.l.f. Beauty Blending Brush. And y'all know my Tarte Clay Clay Volume 2 palette. I don't know why I always say it's three. Um, and I keep this in here. It was what had my Urban Decay. Oh, God. It was what had my Urban Decay Troublemaker and 24-7 Eyeliner in it. But it's so pretty, and I just love it. Okay, next... Okay, in here I keep my Sukari Baby Facial by um, by Drunk Elephant. This is last month's bag from Play by Sephora, which I'm pretty sure I... No, I didn't do a review on it, actually. I'm not sure. Maybe that'll be coming soon. Um, so this is the Urban Decay Troublemaker Mascara. It is awesome. It gives you really long coverage, and it lasts so long. Oh, and I almost forgot this is my last highlighter. Okay, this is my go-to brush pal this this palette, you know, my go-to brush set, and it has um, a large eyeshadow brush, an eyeliner brush, a smudge brush, a contour brush, and a blush brush. So definitely a go-to. It's easy, it's compact, and it comes with great quality brushes. Okay, next up, I just carry this mermaid browsing brush and I use it for blush and occasionally contour which I don't do a lot but and it's just this mermaid pattern and it's super cute and it has this it's really soft and high quality even though it kind of bristles your skin a little bit but not too much obviously my pink beauty blender it's came in a set of three it's the one with like the marble gray and white and the purple one it's just awesome it applies great coverage so i definitely like it a lot urban decay all nighter my go-to spray i spray it every single day and it gives you such good coverage like you have to use neutrogena wipes just to get your makeup off okay next this is one of the things these are three things that I got in my Sephora Play. The other two, which I'm going to be reviewing, were the Sephora Mud Mask, and it comes in this cute little container. <sighs> but the other one was oh, a Bumble and Bumble Hair Thickening Spray, and it's so cute, and I love it so much. But these are three of the things that I've been using in my everyday makeup routine ever since I got them. So this is the, this is like my favorite. This is the Hourglass Veil Mineral Primer, and it's also sunscreen at the same time. But as you can see, literally the packaging on this is amazing. So when you pull it out, it has this little stick, and you just apply it, and it gives you this nice, 
brush of primer so it's amazing like literally I love it so much next up we have the Kat Von D which can be super expensive but their products are awesome um, this is the Kat Von D tattoo liner and it is waterproof liquid eyeliner waterproof Um, this and it's awesome. It goes on really smooth and thick. I'm not the best at applying eyeliner, but this helps a lot. And the last thing that I have in my makeup bag, set, oh wait, no, I have more in there. Set, uh, never mind. Is this Tarte Least Lash Paint from Tarte, and it is great. You just pop the cap off. It's awesome, even though it has that disgusting little piece. It is so good, like it gives thick coverage. And I think I actually have two, three, four things, but you guys have seen these before. This is the Bite Agave Lip Scrub and Lip Balm. And these are my Bite Lip Liner and Bite Lip Gloss in the shades Chai and Glacé. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of short and you've seen most of these products before, but Oh well, um, be sure to stay tuned for my next video, which is going to be using all of these products to make my face look gorgeous. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!